What is up guys? I'm Daddy Gamer Fred and welcome back to another Pokemon Sword and Shield news update video. In today's video, we're going to be redeeming the World Cap Pikachu inside of Pokemon Sword and Shield. I'm pretty hyped for this one because this one is actually a brand new Ash Cap Pikachu inside of the Pokemon games. Now, in before in Pokemon Sun and Moon, Ultra Sun and Moon, when we got the Ash Cap Pikachus, it gave us the original cap, partner cap, Hoenn cap, Sinnoh cap, Anova cap, Chaos cap, and the Aloha cap. And it ended there, obviously, with the games and the anime being in Aloha. There were no world cap at the time now there is and now we got them inside of pokemon sword and shield so let's actually get the cap and see how it looks in game now i'm pretty excited like i said this is my first time seeing it so in order to get it what you need to do is hit up your y menu then hit up mystery gift go to get a mystery gift and then get with code and password i'm gonna have the password on screen the whole time on this video as well as in the description as well as be I'm going to put a comment on this video and ping it so you guys can see down there. Let me know in the comment section below your thoughts on this Pikachu. You need to be connected to the internet. Make sure you're connected to the internet for obvious reasons to pick this up. Let's enter in that password. Boom. We got it entered in. Now, let's see how this Pikachu is going to look. Now, we do have the codes and passwords for all the Pikachus right now. There isn't going to be one after this World Cap Pikachu. So what I'm going to do is at the end of this video, I'm also going to do what I always do, probably have um, the World Class Pikachu inside of a Pokemon camp. And I'm also going to have a montage of all the other Pikachus with their own codes so you guys can grab them. And probably in the description as well, I'll leave all the codes for every Pikachu. Same thing with the pin tweet. So if you are looking for any code, you can redeem them. And I do want to note that this is not one for your Nintendo Switch system or Pokemon Sword and Shield games. You can get multiple Ash Cap Pikachus. In order to do so, you need to have multiple accounts with a save file. Once you have a save file and you're able to get to the mystery gift options, you are able to actually redeem other mystery gifts inside of the game as long as you have a valid code. Now, these codes will end on November 30th. So if you have another game that you, you know, you have another save file on, I recommend picking these up. Again, all you need is a connection to the internet. I do think you need to be connected to, um, the, not the Nintendo Online, but Nintendo Account Service, where basically you can enter in the eShop. I think you need one of those. But again, that is totally free to connect a account to an email. Totally free thing to do. So you can be able to just literally stock up on as much Pikachus as you technically want to, move them over to home potentially, and then, you know, again, just stockpile and have a ton of these. I don't really see them being worth that much to stockpile. I would say just grab an extra set, if anything. So if you know, you ever came across a buddy or somebody that did want to trade, you can trade. You would have that option too. But again, they're shiny lock. So I don't, you know, I don't see the value of these potentially growing where somebody in the future may want to trade you for a particular hat, Ash Cap Pikachu and you not have one on deck already. But, you know, you never know what actually happens. And I, again, while it's cool and it's holding an item, bro. What? It's holding an item? It's holding a light bulb? Now, well, I'm confused because of the fact that none of them came holding an item before. This is the first one that came holding an item. So wait, let's um check summary before we pull this Pikachu out. Again, an item to be held by Pikachu. It's a puzzling orb to boost his attack. Okay. Okay. All right, I'll take it. I didn't know it was going to come home, um, holding an item. That's why I'm just so surprised. Um, we got the original trainer is Ash, which is pretty cool. Inside of the regular ball, which is kind of disappointing to me, uh, to be honest. I really do wish that they came inside Cherish Balls because Cherish Balls you cannot get in-game. So they are only for when the Pokemon Company distributes Pokemon. And this is technically a distribution, but they do not put these Ash Cat Pikachus for whatever reason inside of the Cherish Ball, which I 
think it's a missed opportunity because it will look so dope coming inside the church. Well, I think it has something to do with the fact that Pikachu never jumps into Pokeball. So maybe that's the thing. And it's pretty cool it's, it, with the date. It says it seems that it came from a Pokemon TV program, which it actually does because this is the Ash Cat Pikachu from Ash from the anime. So this is, again, pretty cool. Also has a ribbon if you're into that type of thing. It comes with the classic ribbon, just like all the other Pikachu. So now let's pull Pikachu out and see how it actually looks walking in the game so, so we get a couple of shots of the idle animation of it walking around some walking animations it looks pretty cool it looks pretty cool I, I I am I actually like the white on the hat a lot of the oh no I mean that looks cool it's kind of hard to justify having Pikachu as your walking partner because it walks so slow but I do like it it looks so cool I'm, I'm, I'm in love with this game. The, the, the Crown Tundra and the Isle of Armor adding the walking in um, Pokemon outside the, the the Pokeball to me is like icing on the cake as far as making this game to me one of the definitive Pokemon games out there now. Like it is literally top tier Pokemon game. Let's jump into a camp. So this is the Pikachu inside of Pokemon camp, so we can just get a, a super close Viva? look at Pikachu. Looks pretty cool. I like this hat. It kind of looks like a Pokedex on a hat, but again, not the best hat. I think I, um, for nostalgia reasons, I would never put anything above the regular, um, just classic Ash Cap, but this one looks pretty cool. I can't hate on it. So that's going to be the end of the video for the Ash Cat Pikachus and for all the Ash Cat Pikachus. Again, I'm going to have the codes for these Ash Cat Pikachus inside the description, pinned comment, and probably somewhere on the screen right now so you guys can all grab all of these. Remember, they all end on November 30th and you can re-up again. You can get it again. All you need is another Nintendo account connected to your Nintendo Switch and just get farther enough in the game where you could redeem the mystery gift codes and then redeem all of them again and then potentially move them over to Pokemon Home so you could be able to grab them and just kind of store them there. Now do note that you can't shiny hunt these. These are shiny lock, unfortunately. They actually don't have shiny sprites at all coded in the game. Now, because this is the last of the eight codes, this is going to be it for the Pokemon Ash Cat Pikachu video. So, again, if you want to see me do stuff cool with these Ash Cat Pikachus that I was thinking about doing, like doing like a run with one of these Pikachus, in the comment section below, let me know some dope ideas and I might do it for a future video. Besides that, let me know your thoughts on these Ash Cat Pikachus. Which one is your favorite or do you don't? like these Pikachus at all let me know either way let's have a discussion in the comment section below and if you don't know I do discussion Viva. videos like this all the time discussing Pokemon and other games as well Viva. I answer all comments so let me know your thoughts about it in the comment section below Viva. also if you are new around here consider hitting that subscribe button again like I said I do videos like this every day and if you're enjoying the vibes, hit the subscribe button. Also, hit the like button. It does help me out a ton as far as moving the video and to recommend it so other people can check out the videos. Peace. I love you guys. I'm going to see you guys on the next one. Pikachu! <laughs> yeah, these, these Pikachus are so cute. Pikachu! Oh, whoa, bro, 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 relax, relax. You didn't have to hit me twice. Thank you, thank you, thank you for making it to the end of this video. If you're not a subscriber and you made it this far, hit that subscribe button. You know you want to join the family, ring the bell so you can be notified on the next time I drop one of my videos, as well as hit the like button on this video so it could be recommended so more people can check it out so we can have more people join in the family. If you want to keep up with me on other social media platforms such as Twitter, Instagram, or TikTok or whatever, I'm Daddy Gamer Fred on all 
all of those again daddy gamer fred you'll be able to find all those links in the description of this video and the pin tweet comment on my twitter also on all of my videos i do answer all comments so again if you just want to chat it up about the video or anything just hit me up in the comment section below i take time out of my day and literally answer to all the comments that you guys leave me and i love it and again let's have that conversation down there here are a couple of suggested videos that you guys should check out that may be of your interest i am a variety channel i do tons of stuff tons of pokemon but tons of other stuff as well so dive into these videos peace i love you guys i'm gonna see you guys on the next one